by the power of Minecraft. Hello fellow gamers and welcome back to another Allie Craft Skyblock video. If you don't know how to get on the server, you want to type in mc.allieacraft.net into your server address. You can name it whatever you want and then hit done and it will bring up Allie Craft server right there. You go ahead and click join and it will log you into Allie Craft hub. Here you are in the hub. If it loads, here it comes. Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. We got this cool drill thing coming down it's awesome we got Allie's logo up on the wall we got Allie craft on the other side pretty darn cool not to mention the sweet sweet looking whatever that is in the floor <laughs> pretty sweet so you can go ahead and join prisons skyblock faction survival kit PvP and something else coming soon coming soon to a theater near you so we are going to join Skyblock. Everybody else has been joining on prison, but they're all going to be here in a second because it looks like prison just shut off. So they're all going to be joining back in, but we're going to go ahead and jump into Skyblock because that's where we live. When you come on the server, you're going to find this lovely sign in front of you that says, Welcome to Skyblock. Your adventure begins here. Start your adventure with slash island or slash is will get you to a new island unless you already have one. It'll take you home. So, important information to reclaim purchases here. So you want to go there to reclaim your purchases if you have claimed, or if you have bought something in the past, such as Slash Fly or a rank. So, um, let's see. Are you confused? Slash Health for basic information. And then find out about greenhouses here. So you can go there to find out about greenhouses. And I've showed you some of that in my last video. So that's pretty cool. Ensure you store your vote keys in your ender chest before creating or resetting your island. So if you slash vote get keys or anything, including money, put it in here. Because otherwise, if you do it, you'll lose it. It'll be gone, and then you complain to me, and I'll be like, nah, I don't care, dude. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> anyway, um, so it says we do not, we do not replace lost or stolen items. So if you lost it because you didn't put it in the ender chest... Sorry, dude. It's gone. So, anyway, these are all the rules. Read through them before you start. That's that. We're headed home. Boom. That's the mine menu, just in case nobody knew. This here is my mine menu. I showed it off last time. Pretty darn cool. Back on our island. T Western 74's Island. Very nice. Very cool. Very cool. Very nice. Last time we went ahead and set up our sugarcane farm, which I will slash fly and show you all up here. Again. Show you again, again. Look at there. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Add a little accents to it because I like the accents. They're nice. And uh, down here we got production going on. Look at that. Pretty sweet. So what we were, I was thinking about doing today, since we got this set up, this is going to be our remote control system. So what we're going to do is run the redstone that comes off of this bad boy right back here. And we're going to set it up so that it goes, I'm not exactly sure where to put it, 100% um, sure, but I'm thinking maybe right up there. I don't know if there or there would be better. So if you come out here, I've got the uh, greenhouses, which I want to move this one down because it blocks my sign, man. Blocks the sign, dude. We don't need that block of the sign, che. So um, if I do that then that would be cool because it would be down below and be a lot better off. Um, I need to cover up that too. I don't like the black lines up there. They're kind of ugly. Don't like it too ugly. So that's kind of the plan on what I want to do is get a few things taken care of. Maybe set that up right now. Let's go ahead and throw away some of the stuff we have from last episode. Because I don't think we need it. I don't think we need it. Most of it, anyway. So let's go over here. Blocks. Grab the... Throw this in there. Uh, sneak, cobblestone. Why not? Sure. Throw that in there, too. We don't need it. All right. So we're going to grab some ch uh, stone brick. I think we're going to do some stone brick. Grab some quartz just because we have quartz. And quartz is good for you. And grab this uh, chest. Throw that in there. Those in there. That in there we don't need it and I'm gonna test something else too I'm gonna grab some of that 
Uh, we're gonna need a, another but well, I've got we're gonna need another bucket. Oh, yeah, I only have what seven buckets get out of here Get out of here. We only need two buckets Only need two just cuz I like two buckets. Okay. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna take no I'm gonna leave this coal here cuz we can trade with villagers what is that doing in there? Anyway, wow, okay. So we're going to throw that over here in Swords and Tools. Because we can. And my shell's almost broken, so that's why I grabbed another one. Because we kind of need another one. So I have this extra guy. <laughs> I wanted to test a couple things. So right now, if I open my inventory, you can see I have Haste 3. I have this guy. This guy. And I think... I think my beacon, this beacon over here, or no wait, where is the beacon of doom? The beacon's over here. I have this beacon set at haste, I believe. No one knows, it's magical. Okay, well then, alright. Maybe we'll set that to like regen or something then, really quick since we're here. We might as well, we might as well, let's do that. Grab a piece of iron, head back over to the... Uh, beacon we have full beacon under here we have, I think it's all diamond blocks or something anyway um so let's do region oh maybe that's where my strength is coming from that makes sense I think I already activated it with with a uh, strength two so I could kill mobs better we'll just go ahead and reactivate that on strength two yep <laughs> there we go strength two so haste three so I wanted to test the haste, so I'm going to take this out, put it there, and then see if that one drops it down to haste 2. Because that would be interesting if it was stackable, then you can get like haste 5 or something crazy. Because I've got, um, I've got one, one more, so I mean we could stack those, I've got three all together. We could stack those and have like haste 4. Or something, I don't know, that'd be so cool. But like, I can rip through my whole island in two seconds. But anyway, too much fun, too much fun, boys. Alright, so we're gonna head up here. I think this is gonna be the best spot. I'm gonna redo this, um, probably off camera. Um, make it smaller. I just thought, back when my spawners weren't working properly, that if I made the skeletons travel all the way down here, and then all the way down there, and then back again, they'd spawn more so <laughs> if you look in here if I can there we go if you look in here I've got a lift system on here so um, basically the skeletons spawn in there's actually three spawners here they're all part of one so they all spawn in see three skeletons at a time and so they're on a travel up system so and really dude dude I'm trying to explain why you shoot me why you shoot me punk don't do this oh you want to fight huh all right fine fine Fine. Oh, your buddy wants to fight now. Get out of here. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Jeez, I'm being thrown around by the skellies. All right. <laughs> well, more and more spawn. Anyway, so they're on a lift up system. They lift up, lift up, lift up, lift up. If you don't know how to do that, I'm going to run a tutorial on how to do that in your own island because it is pretty darn cool. And it's really helpful if you have a low mob spawner. You can actually pick them up higher and not, and not have them on, like, on a one grid um, hallway because the one grid hallways like this one are really kind of a pain to get them all separated and all that kind of thing and you can't spawn them all into one little area so I'll show you guys how to do the lift up system later I gotta fix that staircase later once I get this fixed so I'm just gonna have them come in and drop down right straight here because it's just gonna be a lot better and easier that way so I want to get to level 160, we're at 157 right now, and climbing, so as long as I don't die or something crazy, then we'll be good to go, because dying would be bad, I am, and I wouldn't like it very much, would not make me feel very good, so I think, let me see, we want the bottom of this to be right, probably right here, and then uh, we'll go ahead and put in this... Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Counting with two West and seventy-four. All right, so we're gonna go eight. Okay, that's not gonna work for me. So one, two, three. So we need to remove one, two, three. Because you guys know, I like everything to be even. 
I don't like it to be off-center. I don't like it to be crooked. It's not good, not fun, and drives me mad. So we shall make sure it is even. Because I like even. Did I count that right? <laughs> I don't even know. So there we go. All right, so now we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we're two more over, which is fine. One there. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Alrighty then. Very, let me recount. Recount! Recount inbound. One, whoops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two. Very good. Boom, right there. Okay, that is much better. It's not exactly straight though, I don't think. Which, I think it comes down to the pattern, maybe? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So two. And then there's two there, so okay. So that's good, that's fine and dandy and shpadamdy. That works. So what we're gonna do is block up the windows behind here. Because if we don't, then when we hit the water flow down and let the water flow down, like water likes to flow, it's going to ruin my nether portals, and I'll be very unhappy because it took forever to build those. Ah. All right, cool. So we got this one middle section here that's going to be where our drop is going to be, and it's going to be out here somewhere. So that's going to be our middle section. We already know that it kind of points to the middle section, so pretty straightforward. Go ahead and grab, let's see, a little bit of these. A little bit of that, a little bit of goodness. All right, let's see. I want water to be behind. So, yes, water there. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah. We can't decide, I can't decide, I can't decide. But there we go, put that in there. Drop this in on this side like this. Boom, boom. All right, cool. Now we'll grab our bucket, which we forgot to refill the other bucket. Come on, man, what are you doing? We've done. We've got to refill the bucket. Let's go over and refill the bucket. Let's grab them both while we're here. Boom. And boom. So if you were on the server earlier today, um, when this is being filmed, then um, the prisons got overwhelmed by players. Which is cool. We all like to see that. It's really awesome. And hopefully pretty soon we're going to be getting another prison up and running for you all to join your own prison. Because... Ali decided to make a video on prisons and started his prison series. So, if you guys all want to join up with him on prisons, feel free to do so. Jump on aliacraft.net and get your own prison and start playing over there with, uh, hopefully you'll see Ali A on the server from time to time. So, that would be mighty cool if you did. Because he really seems to enjoy his prison for some reason. So, <laughs> anyway... Let's see. Oh, did I screw that up? I think I may have screwed that up a little bit. Not a big deal. I don't think. If it is, it is, right? That's what you're going to do. Okay, so we're going to grab some of that. Yeah. Yeah, I shouldn't have put in the water yet. Because I need sand there, not dirt. Or not dirt. Not quartz. Which is unfortunate, because... It's such a beautiful material. We like it so very much. So we would just want to break it that far because otherwise we're going to run into water running down in our nether portal. I don't need that business because it's too crazy. Make a big old mess. Don't need a big old mess up on my island. So we're going to go ahead and lay these down here. Break those three. And pick these up here like show. We'll go into our inventory, and I don't have any more. Okay, cool. Nice. Um, throw these down. Okay. And then we're going to go back around and pick these up. Because we de don't need these anymore at the moment. So all of this is going to run. This, this one, this one. This one will be this one, okay? So this will all run into the system down below. Oh dear, I just did it. I did it. I did it, guys. I broke it. Please don't break the nut. Oh good, it went the other way. Yay! Yay for me! It went the other way! Alright, we're going to break this one. I can't believe I just did that. 
I did not realize I did not have these underneath. Because you need that and that. You need that right there to stop the water from flowing. Luckily, <laughs> it went the other way because there's a deeper hole over there than there is over there. Not that big a deal, but it would have been really annoying to have to redo. I'm sure you guys understand. We don't like redoing stuff. All right, let's see what else we got here. We got we got stone brick. We got stone brick. So we're gonna put stone brick up there, like that. We're gonna break these out. Three, four, five. Whoops! See, doodle did it again. Smooth. Be really smooth. Let's see if we can break. Nope. Let's go on the other way again. Yay! We still didn't screw it up. That's amazing. That's amazing. Yeah, we're gonna go boom, boom, boom. Very good. And then boom. One right there. Okay. Throw our sand in here. Now we can break these. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Sort of. <laughs> if I wouldn't have screwed it up in the first place, we wouldn't be doing this in the next video. anyway. Alright, so we're gonna just build that out to there. Come back in here. Grab this block. This one, this one, this one. Beep to beep to bop to boop. Like that. <coughs> Put down our sand. I always misplace one block. Why is that? It's like the one block of doom. Always have blocks of doom, and I don't know why. I wish Minecraft didn't come with blocks of doom, because if it didn't, then I wouldn't have blocks of doom. Well, then I wouldn't have commentary. That'd just be a bummer, wouldn't it? And I did... Well, how did... Really? Boom. Don't break my portal. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. Whew. Safe. We're safe. It didn't break the portal. Yay. All right. <laughs> Not like it would be that big a deal. Okay, so we're going to set up um, the sugar cane right here. So we're going to need the... Let me think. So we need the pistons up there. Let's break these out right here. Yeah, there's obsidian behind this. So should be all right. Ooh, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know, man. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Basically, I'm not sure how this is going to look, but it's not going to matter that much because you're not going to see this side as much. With the sugar cane farm right there, it's going to be right in its face anyway, so you're not going to see this. I just hope it's not... It shouldn't mess with the redstone either. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, it might actually because we're going to have to stair step it. So, and if you, we can't break... The obsidian, you see what I'm saying? We gotta stair step it. If we stair step it, we'll have to break a piece of obsidian, which will break the nether portal, which will be, be annoying. Maybe not. I don't know. We'll see how it goes, guys. I don't know. I don't know. It's just beautiful. That's all I know. Alright, so let's see. This piece. Okay, so we're probably gonna need to break that down a little bit. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. We'll probably just skip this section, but the sugar cane will go there, and then we'll have a water sheet, I believe, will probably be the best way. We'll sheet the water right down here with a glass um, barrier in the way, and then it'll sheet it down to either this side or that side of this, and then it'll collect. So, yeah, I think that'll work out pretty good. You can't see it from down here. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to clean all this up, get this gone um, off camera because it's kind of oogly and I don't like it. So I might just do that, get the setup prepped, ready to go for um, finishing this off. And then I will be back um, then. So, all right. Um, it'll just be a second for you guys, but it'll probably be like an hour for me. <laughs> all right. Two words. And welcome back. I'm back for a second. I went ahead and got that part all cleaned up, cleaned up, and uh, it's looking pretty nice over there. We've got some rotten flesh that we don't need to get rid of that. Throw that in there and get rid of those. Don't need those. Okay. So we got that. I got that all cleaned up. It's looking pretty fancy schmancy now. And uh, the spawner works really good. As you can see, my level is almost. Almost. I mean, we got 109. 109 XP before we are a, now 97. 91. Come on. 85. 81. 
almost there. So the seas, as you can see, the spawner works a lot better now. They don't travel as far, and uh, they all kind of group together and are good to go. So we are 14 away, and no, we're in eight more. We need eight more XP, and then we are level 160, and we're going to rank up. I want to show you that real quick, and we need one more. Whoop, I heard a skelly spawn. Did you hear him? Oop, there he is. Boom. One more. Come on. Yeah, 160 on the button. Now, if you were wondering, here's how you do it. So once you get to your levels that you need to actually um, get uh, ranked up, you go slash R-A-N-K-U-P, rank up. You hit that, and then you'll see in here you got level 1 is, uh, is 40 XP, level 2, 60, level 3, 80, level 4, 100, level 5, 120, level 6, 140, whoops, level 7 is 160. So as you can see, I clicked on, um, and it says down here in chat, you already have ranked up to this level. So level seven, I have 160 XP. Now, when you do this, it's going to take all of your XP from you. 160 XP, level seven, ready for GG's in chat. Here we go. Boom. Level seven. GG, everybody's going to GG. So level seven, that's a hard one. Level eight is even worse. So we're going to go ahead and slash mute. Uh, Mr. Oh, never mind. No, maybe. Mute Asher. Uh, Asher, Asher, Asher. Did he leave? I miss. I think he left. Gotta love it. People come in and curse and chat and then they leave. Gotta love it. Anyway, um, that's just what people do. I mean, if you guys get on the server, just be nice. I mean, come on. Everybody's trying to have a good time and have fun. You don't have to be all rude to people. It's just the way it is. So, as you can see, I have zero levels. I need seven to get up to level one. And boom. <laughs> so, um, almost level one. Let me go. Come on. There we go. Level two. So, anyway, now I've got to get all my XP back up. So, if you do slash rank up again, there's level eight, the infamous 200 levels. Very difficult, difficult to get, but attainable just as long as you don't die. Because we don't have like an XP bottle thing where you can bottle it on here because people were abusing it so we don't actually have that on here unfortunately anymore because otherwise it'd be a lot better if you go to the nether you could bottle it up that'd be cool but we don't have that so and i'm gonna just keep on working on working on getting this all uh finished i want to get that done up there for the most part and then i will be back when we get that uh wait a second there's a pigman arm it's a pig it's a new minecraft block <laughs> that was really bizarre. Anyway, off camera, I went ahead and accidentally broke my bow. I can't believe it. My bow is broken, gone, dusted, and it's not good. So we're going to run down really quick since I'm still here. Uh, and we're not working on that right now. We're going to grab and look in one of these chests. All my item frames got deleted off my chest also, so I can't tell what's what, where's what, and how's it, who's it. Anyway, so here's all of our bows, I think... There it is. There, I've got two Christmas bows left. So from the Christmas kit. So, uh, which is kind of cool, kind of handy. So um, there it is. The only problem with it is that if you get in, if I go into, go into the chest over here. This chest here, grab mending out. See if you notice on the bow, it doesn't have mending. So I was like, oh, you know what I'm gonna do, mange. I'm gonna put on me some some mending on that bow. That there bow can be mendable, mendable. And if you throw it in the table and go to put that on, it says no. Sorry, boys, you can't do it. So apparently, when they did this bow, they made it so you can't actually re-enchant anything onto this bow, and it kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, I was trying. I was gonna fix my other bow before it broke, but I got into a big old fight with one of the uh, bosses and was going ham and just did not pay attention and it broke. Not a big deal because I mean we do have two more so it's not like the end of the world or anything but it was really annoying because I was I was just going to wait till it was like down to zero on its uh, on its bar and then go ah, I fixed you but it didn't work out <laughs> unfortunately. So anyway I'm going to go ahead and get back to work on the um on the sugarcane farm and system and then I will be back and show you all that goodness when the time comes. Alright, welcome back guys. 
we are back here and I went ahead and started setting up the redstone for the back side of the sugarcane farm that I started earlier and as you can see we cleared that out now if you guys have any suggestions on what you want that wall to look like or if you want me to put like something in that wall or something cool 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 like that just let me know in the comments and I'll take a look at that and see uh, what we want to do with it because it looks pretty cool but I want to fix it and make it look better so because it's kind of a blank slate at the moment so and um, as you can see I designed up all the windows and all that other stuff so I kind of want to design up that wall too so if you guys have any ideas and want to send that my way, I'll be looking for it. And we'll, we'll try to make it pretty. So if you guys weren't sure how I did the um, the double piston extension that happens down in the other one down there when it goes when the system goes off on the back side, you make them all go off at the same time by placing a repeater down here and a block right up next to the... Uh, let me just show you. It's probably easier. A block right next to there's the two pistons so you want to put a block there repeater running into the block then another repeater then a block repeater block so on and so forth so these are already covered up and I've got the blocks on top of them already and so we got one more that goes right there now what you want to do is you want to take your redstone and hopefully we have enough I have 11 not maybe not enough anyway you want to put one here and then skip that block put one in the hole skip that one put it in the hole skip that one put it in the hole because if you put them on top of here um, it'll glitch out so you don't want it you don't want them on top now this one is fine to connect to here so that's going to go to the next set as you can see here I separated them out so you can now see um, that this piece that goes to our spawner above us isn't going to affect hopefully too much of the uh, spawns and all that good jazz and that'll just give us a little extra sugar cane so we're going to go ahead and pop one we don't necessarily need that one so um, I'm gonna put one there anyway but uh, no yeah you do because you need to power that one so okay yep so it's it's on every other block and don't connect them on the top because that'll ruin the whole thing you can actually go back when you're done with this system and what's it's kind of nice about it is you can actually cover the whole thing up just like this just go ahead and cover it uh, with stone and that way if water anything ever escapes your notice and it runs down into your redstone it's not going to ruin your entire build because it's covered so you won't have any problems with uh, water and your redstone being gone because that is a major issue when it comes to redstone as if you've ever done redstone you well know that when water comes about it's a scary thing now all we got to do is figure out exactly what we want to do. Oh, I had to break these nether portals here and lower them down by one, which I did. So they're lowered down by one. You can't hardly tell from the inside or the outside. I mean, you can see it there a little bit, but it's not that big a deal. I don't think uh, it looks bad or anything. So it's it is what it is. I left them off because it's really annoying working around them trying to, <laughs> you guys know, it's, it's nether portal stuff, man. It sucks. It makes too much noise. It hurts my brain. So I turned them off. <laughs> so there you go. All right, now we got to figure out exactly what we want to do with this system. So this is our torch that leads our signal out. Now, if we go down, if you look down here, whoop see we're underneath the ceiling now what we can do from here is build it out one and then down and under so that we can go back up and probably put in something here I would not thinking probably right here probably is gonna look the best and then we'll cover that straight over in that block with those blocks so what we're gonna need for that obviously is torches and blocks which I don't really well no I guess I do have some blocks right here very good cool I think I'm gonna build it out of that yeah that's what we're gonna do alrighty we got it we got it so we're gonna go ahead and put this down there this will break and see you Mr. Block have a nice day <laughs> he fell down <laughs> It's terrible. I'm gonna go get it. Anyway, wait, did it get erased? Ah, did I lose it? Oh no. Oh well. No, maybe I got it. Picked it up. 
anyway, not a big deal. We're gonna build down here like that, so we can go downstairs. Do do do. One two three. Like that. Actually, let me. Hmm. Let me rethink this a little bit. What we could do, maybe. Hmm. Hmm. I was thinking using the red or the. Uh, this block here, this one, you know, the glowstone. Glowstone, yeah, when my brain works. The glowstone as a stepping down, but I can't remember if you can go up glowstone or down glowstone. I don't remember. Um, yeah, my brain's not working on what... Anyway, maybe we'll just go ahead and continue it on like this. When I figure it out, I might change it. So there we go. We're going to make it basically a little trough over to a certain point. That was smart, huh? That was smart. My brain's not working very well today. So we're going to make a little trough down to here. This is going to be our up point. So the trough is going to run along here like that. Do I have any more? No, I don't. <gasps> oh, no. Hopefully we're not out of quartz. Um, I might need to go get some more. Oh, we have 19. That might be enough to do part of it. And that will be good. So this is basically an extension of the last video for the most part. Just extending this system up to that system is my goal to get done. We're going to go down here, fly back up, and then build it. We need to go to there, blah, 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 blah. I think I want to come straight off this way into here that way. I think that's what I want to do because that way it cuts off a bit more of this area of having to use that area. Don't know, I might change this redstone part up a bit just to make it match into the walls a little bit better later on my own time or something. Uh, just because it's going to be a lot easier to do when I have time to just really think about it and not have to worry about uh, commentating, the commentation, the commentation of the Lomade Dut Bada Boopa. Yep, yep, yep. That there, that there. So we're going to create what's called a torch tower. And if you don't know what a torch tower is, learn some redstone. I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, I'm going to show you right here. Basically, it goes up each block, each torch. You notice that one's on, that one's off, that one's on, that one's off, so on and so forth. And it just goes up. And then that way, they alternate. And when it gets a signal and the signal changes, then each tor torch will change in turn. So, I'm just going to do that because it's whoopsie doodle da day. Whoopsie doodle da day. Like that there. Put that there. Anyway. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Look at that. Very nice. Down to our torches and boom, 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 and boom. And this one is going to be off. Alright, so this one is now off, as you can see. Now, interesting things about redstone. If you don't know that much about redstone, this, it probably won't help you much. <laughs> but if I do that, right there, and then we change the signal, which you'll notice everything changes all the way up. Uh, maybe not. Let's go back down and try it again. Uh, this one, there we go, because the other one was off. I think that should have changed there we go. now see this will affect that right next to it when it's right next to it so if you try to put it on a block it's not gonna work if you try to put this like this if you try to do this I will show you because it's, it's easier we don't need the axe right now put that there and then put that there, you'll notice it doesn't work. You gotta remember, redstone travels through the, the block that it's on. So this can't pick up a signal because it's not up against anything. The, these pick up their signal on the side, okay? Not from underneath, and it's a block up. So if you remember that, that's gonna help you with redstone in the future to go, oh, this is on the same plane, I can do that. So there's your signal, okay? So I'm gonna go back down, put these torches back in, and that's going to shut it off. So there it goes. And now it's shut off. And we have somebody that's going to TP to us right now. I'm just going to see what he's doing. What's going on? What's he doing? Hey, buddy, buddy. Hey, buddy, buddy. Welcome to YouTube. Evan, Evan Games 13. How's it going, buddy? 
Um, you probably want to come down here, but I don't think you have Slash Fly. Let's see. Will he die? <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Will he die? Will he die? Will he die? Doo -doo. Da -da. Yeah, he doesn't have Slash Fly. <laughs> Which could be very detrimental to his health. Let's grab a bucket. Oh, he's got it. Okay, never mind. He's good. He's good. He's good. He's the man. He's the man. He got down. No problem. No problem. All right. Cool. I don't know what he's up to. Why he's here on my island. But that is okay. I do not mind being on my island. Okay. I do not mind at all. It's okay. He's a good guy. I guess. I do not know. All right. So we were working on. No, we're out of redstone. Oh, the last piece of redstone. No, we have more at home. Slash home. Slash home. Thank you. Alrighty. Well, over here, we're going to grab some more out of our chest. A little more redstone going down. We're going to go slash back. And whoa, look, we're right back here again. Lay this down here. Boom. Just like that. Now, when this system goes off down there, this system will go off up here. Which is pretty darn handy because it's all gonna be the same thing. It's all going to be um, dish doofs. Why is he keep tipping to me? I do not know. Let us just accept it again. I don't know what he's got going on. I don't think he said anything in chat. I didn't see anything in chat from him. Mr. Evan Games 13, how's it going, buddy? I accepted your TP. Where are you? Where you at, bud? Come on, come on in, come on in. There he is. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Evans, Evan Games 13. What if he does YouTube videos? That'd be kind of cool. We'll have another YouTuber on the channel. That'd be pretty sick, but I don't know for sure. So we're going to go ahead up, back up here. Back up here, back up here, back up here. Back up here. Fly up here. And look at this. This is very nice and very beautiful. How did you become a mod? Well, I became a mod. Um, I was a mod on LEA Craft um, Arcade and moved here. There we go. Hopefully that answers a little bit of his questions, because if you guys don't know, I was on Skyblock, or Sky... Arcade, when I was, uh, when I started mod. So, that's where I started, was on Arcade, and did Sky Wars and all that good stuff, and had a great time there, and unfortunately, yeah, it, uh, it got ripped and is no more, but, you know, that's the way it goes. He says... How did you become mod there? Slash R. I put in for um, in or when f I put in for it when we had when we had uh, an interviews and got it. We got helper and worked my way. Wow, I can't type today. Way up. Anyway, there we go. Uh, hopefully that answers his questions. What else we need to do with this, guys, is hit the pigmen. All right. <gasps> Watch all the pigmen come in. There's thousands of pigmen trying to kill us. Oh my. Hey guys, you're missing the party over here. Come on. <laughs> it was our own, our own pigment farm without a spawner, boys. Our own pigment farm without a spawner. You don't need a spawner when you got pigment coming in like crazy. When do interviews happen, and how do you get into them? Slash R. Interviews will be. On the form that can be forms um, and, and details will be on there. There we go. 
And we gotta get rid of these pigmen. Wow, there's a bunch of pigmen in here, which is good XP, and we need to get to level 200 somehow. <laughs> might be another, like, 15 episodes later. I might get, actually, get, um, gee, 200 levels. That'd be amazing. Ow, you did hurt, bro. What's up with that? Why you hit me, punk? Why you hit me? What, was it these chickens that were hitting me? These are just chickens. I know it was the chickens. Dang chickens. Die, chickens. Oh, it's you. You want to fight? You guys want to fight. Oh, you want to fight. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wait. Another one. Another one. Another one. Uh, anybody else? Wait. Oh, you want to fight over here? Punk? Huh? 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 Oh, that was an enderman. Went right through his head. Look at that. What the heck? Y'all seeing that? That's weird. Whoa. What? Something's breaking my doors. What's breaking my doors? What the heck? Dude, don't be breaking my doors, man. What's up? Is a zombie pigment breaking my doors? What's going on? the heck? Dude, don't do that. That is not very nice. I didn't know zombie pigments break doors. That's something else. You guys see that Enderman? That was pretty cool. I've rarely seen an e that, that it was like through the Ender... Whoops. Where'd he go? It's through that Ender portal. <laughs> or that, that Ender portal. That Nether portal. And it was bizarre. <laughs> it was like arrow into Enderman. Arrow into Enderman. Arrow into Enderman. <laughs> like what? How is this possible? Oh my. Anyway, I'm having too much fun, you guys. Um, we got all sorts of mobs up in here. Look at this. Oh my god, there's mobs for days and nights and cities. Woo! This is nice. A witch in there? Oh my. Let's use our slashy thing. Here we go. It's uh, 1.8 PvP or swords on here, but if you use the 1.9 or the 1. Uh, the 1.8 swinging. It doesn't do half as much damage as if you do the 1.9 slow swing. It's like, well, what's the point? Except for on like these mobs. It seems to work on these mobs okay, but it's still, it works so much better if you do that 1.9 battle strategy. And, it, and it's 1.9, but I, I don't know. I, whoa, scared me. Anyway. <laughs> I'm like, pigment, die! Anyway, alright. Hey guys, anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, I will be finishing up the rest off camera, trying to get this uh, all set up and ready to go get the glass, get the water thing going, getting all that good jazz. Look at my little dolly. I've got a dolly. Anyway, um, <laughs> I'm having too much fun. Anyway, I hope you guys all enjoyed. Get on the server, aliacraft.net. Join us all here. Aliacraft is doing, or Alia is doing prisons. Stuff like that. So join him on there or join me here on Skyblock. We also got Phoenix Magic here. She also does YouTube videos. Look her up as well. She does YouTube videos here on Ali Craft also. So I hope you guys did enjoy. And I will see you all later.